The excitement was intensified just a little bit on the high school football field tonight for one Southeast Texas team. If I were to say at the start of the year, the Newton Eagles would be the last football team from our area still standing in the playoffs, you would have thought that to be too far-fetched. If I said Newton would be within one win for playing for state, that too wouldn't be considered a fairy tale. Yet, it has been a fairy tale season this year for the Newton squad. And would that fairy tale continue? And would Newton get a shot at playing for state next week? First, they'd have to get past Cameron Yo at Woodforce Bank Stadium this evening. Newton would start off just as they have all year. Dale Dean under center, handing off to Brandon Johnson. And then it becomes a mad dash for the end zone, a race that Johnson's going to win with ease. Newton strikes first, much to the delight of those fans that made the trip to Shenandoah just outside the Woodlands. Eight zip, Eagles up early on. Newton would look to extend, still first quarter. Dale Dean rolls out of the pocket and then just takes off. Doesn't even tuck the ball. He's got it out there in his hand. He goes in untouched. Smooth sailing. Eagles up 14 to 8. Cameron Yo back to punt. Newton D coming up big. The kick block. Romando Stewart gets it cleanly and takes it in for the score. Newton extended their lead. Wanted more. They go for two after that TD and Dean runs it in on the far side. Newton would lead Cameron Yo 22 to 8 as we move into the second quarter. Purple power looked like it was electrifying out there, but Cameron Yo would battle back. They scored 17 unanswered in the second quarter, and Newton, for the first time all year, trailed at the half down 25 to 22. And as we go to the final in this one, it's hard to see for Newton fans, but Cameron Yo is moving on 39 22 was the final in favor of the Yeoman. Newton, Newton didn't score past that first quarter. Congrats to Newton on a great season, 13-1 and one, and state semifinalists.